Welcome back everyone! Welcome back to Let's Play American Truck Simulator! We've just arrived at our, de uh, at our destination in Ellie. Uh, we brought some of the emergency scaffolding to Plaster and Sons. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on there. They'll probably be going to be peeling off the overcoat of those things and probably uh, I don't know, like silver underneath or something. Gold bars. <laughs> anyway, we're looking for another freight now, but I'm thinking we should probably... Oh, look at that. 18 tons of propane. Um, we should probably go and fuel up our truck and also find a rest stop and then possibly try to go to Utah to like Provo Price or Vernal. So, let me actually see. It's not much here in this town. Right, let's see. We want a gas station, which is over there. Well, we don't necessarily need a gas station, I suppose. We could do it on the way there. So, we just need to go and rest. Alright, let's do that. gonna be a bump. 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 It's kind of weird to actually feel that in the steering wheel with the force feedback. It's quite cool. Ugh, I gotta reach my blinkers. Which are of course the paddle shifters. Oh, isn't that a... F that's a Ford like B-Max I think. Not an S-Max but... Ooh, already over the speed limit. Gotta be careful. Don't have a trailer. <laughs> Alright, so there's the rest stop. On the right, we'll do that. We still have 729 miles of distance. But of course, right now we're not pulling anything, so that might be the case. Alright, there's the rest area. Uh, where? So just pull in here, right? Ah, oh, there it is. Um, uh, but all right, there we go. Shut off everything. Brakes. <laughs> and let's sleep. Oh, it's raining. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Next day, seven thirty in the morning. Let's check the job, shall we? I wish it was this easy to actually do trucking and make money. <laughs> I have a feeling everyone would be doing it. Look at this! Again, Plaster and Sons to Plaster and Sons. Scaffolding, really highly paid. There's something going on with that scaffolding. Something's going on. Alright, so we need Provo, Price, or Vernal. Or actually, let me just see. Salt Lake City would work as well. Fracting only three tons. It's quite well paid for what it is. Um, but I can understand that more. It's probably a expensive piece of equipment of some sort. Utah. That's the only one that goes to Utah. Pressure tank. I suppose we'll take this. And even though it's out of the way of Salt Lake City, we'll, we'll probably have a better chance of getting one of these destinations in Salt Lake City. Like, So Vernal... See, Vernal, Vernal, Vernal. Nothing. Come on. Construction houses. Look at them. Alright. So, uh, frax tank. Three tons. Is that even worth the fuel? Ready to roll. <laughs> uh. Oh, wait a second. I don't seem to have the air brake simulation because we would start at zero right now. Huh. Finding new route. Unless of course it's still there from Stay right the night before. Continue straight. I mean yesterday that's I don't know. I don't think it would hold pressure Go for that. Straight. Ah what happened? Okay, let's find a new route. Turn left. 
Turn left. Oh yeah, I don't have a trailer. <laughs> don't have to be that careful. The police officer. Wait, is everyone? Oh no, they do have lights on. I thought everyone had lights off. gonna be red. Turn left. Lovely weather to do some hauling, don't you agree? And yeah, look at how much better this is without that stupid visor up top. You can actually see the bloody traffic lights. Woo! Oh yeah, that's something. I'm kind of missing for this game, maybe. I don't think it has any ambient occlusion. That's why the cars look like they're sort of floating above the road. Yeah, I think ambient occlusion would uh, add quite a lot of fidelity. But then again, I'm not, I'm not sure. I don't think there's any. Forty-five, yeah. Just gonna put cruise control on. We're right there anyway. Is this another rest stop? No. Thought it was, but it's just some invisible bushes. Only m bushes now now revealing themselves. And there's the uh, gas station actually. I would like to get that. I'm probably not allowed to go. Get ready to turn right. Through this side. Oh yeah, okay. Oh, excuse me. Turn right. Just got some fuel. Right. I know I still have my wipers on, but we're about to go anyway. 326 for a gallon. Not great. Not horrible. And boom! Let's go! $659. That's actually not much. Whenever I hear that sound, I always think, oh wait, oh no, I've done something wrong and I've been billed. Try to slide this thing. No, refuses to do so. I guess, uh. I don't think you can turn off traction control. Well, you can lock the diffs, but. Wow, look at this refinery here. Off the wipers. Finally, we are here. All right, let's get that fracking container or whatever it is. Frack tank. Three tons. Not worth my time, but it is going in the right direction. So, tis what it is. That is some funky reflection. blocky and weird. Oh, it's not that. Oh! <laughs> That's an interesting thing. Well, of course, it's so light, it doesn't actually need more than just the rear tires, I suppose. There we go. Okay, Touch that. here we go. Yeah, it's like I have nothing behind me. That's funny. I 
I can shut off my lights now. Oh, sorry. I wanted to go into 7 high instead of 5 high. Oh my god, look at that. I don't even need to split the gears. That's funny. That's funny. <laughs> Alrighty, gotcha. Stop at a stop sign. Uh, there's stuff coming now. You know what? Power! Oh, they're still far behind. We're fine. I'm not getting stuck behind the bus again. So where are we going? We're going back there. And I suppose north. Get ready to turn right. Las Vegas. Turn right. Come to a complete stop. See if it's okay. It is. And uh, I cannot reach my button for range selection. There. Yeah, when I turn my wheel and my yeah, the buttons are all upside down and everything. Go straight. Shum. Oh, what's going on there? What? I've never seen that in... Like, in the middle of the road. Look at that. It's, uh... Did they actually crash and that's how the fire truck puts its hazards on? Just turns on all the lights? That's interesting. So what's this guy gonna do? You just gonna wait there, bud? No, nope, he's actually gonna avoid that. That's cool, I've never seen that before. Let's avoid them. And let's rubberneck. The car's- oh no, it was a crash! That's cool. I like little details like that. I'm never gonna overtake this truck anyway, but... Go straight. Come on, give me green. Uh. Power! Power! No, power. <laughs> oh, here's turning right. Oops. What a cute little town this is, though. I like it. Come on, guys. Merge. There you go. Lovely. Lovely. Yeah. <laughs> Pulling this trailer is really funny, actually. I really don't feel like we have a trailer. You you feel that, right? I mean, feel it, but... You see that in the way we're accelerating. Look, 7 high. Uh, well, I can't accelerate now, but... If I t were to do full throttle... Look, this is full throttle. See? Accelerates just fine. Hey, nice truck. Well, let's split gears anyway. <laughs> because we can. 
Yeah, that, that doesn't feel like there's much behind us. <laughs> Power. Power. I don't think these guys are actually going 70. More like 63. That's turbo. When when it settles into a uh, cruise control speed, and then it just goes as it. Add some throttle here and there. <laughs> Lovely. Lovely. Oh, they're overtaking that truck. Come on, guys. You had a chance to overtake there. No, you don't. What is that truck doing? Doing 40. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing, man? I guess he's brake checking me. <laughs> that could be a thing. Okay, come on. Go for it now. Go. It's free. Go. Go. Come on, go. <laughs> It's an empty road. Yeah, driving very economically. Pedal to the metal, jake brake. Pedal to the metal, jake brake. Or exhaust brake, really, I think. There you go. Let's see. Can't really see past corner. Oh, and now he just accelerates. Yeah, now he just goes crazy. Look at that. As soon as I'm behind him, he goes crazy. Oh, that truck ain't gonna overtake me. No, sir. Look at that. It's bloody mad man. Mad Max. Motel. Oh god, that's a rickety. Ugh, that's abandoned actually. I, yeah, it's completely abandoned. Just put cruise control on. I have a feeling the the contractors won't get their frack tank. They'll get frack tank pieces in there. It'll look good from the outside, but in on the inside it'll be just cogs and pieces. And oh, you're going left. What, 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 what are you doing? <sighs> I'm not braking. No. Drivers want it. It is not a choice. It is a ch- What? It is not a choice. It is a child on the top right. What, like, transporting? What? <laughs> I have no idea what they mean. Okay, so if there's gonna be a straight here, I think there's gonna be a straight. Don't you dare accelerate. Come on. I think it's... Come oh, on! I cannot actually overtake here. It's a Now I can. No! Power! Power! Unlimited power! Uh, sorry about that. That felt good. Not, not really what I would suggest doing in real life. You would need a bigger stretch of road, and that guy shouldn't have uh, been accelerating like that if I was overtaking him, but hey, we got a more powerful engine. We took him on and took him out. Yeah. 
Here's the victory ditty. There. Oh, look at that road. Oh, oh I love that. Desert. S long road. Well, straight road, I wanted to say, but never mind that. That's pretty cool. Three hours to go. Oh, oh. I don't really need to brake. Don't really need a brake. I'll stay at cruise control 7 to 2. I know I've programmed a uh, resume cruise control as well, but I cannot remember which one it was. Was it? Let, let's see. Yeah, it's this one. Okay. It's the share button because, you know, you gotta have a share button on your steering wheel. I have no clue why there would be a share button. It's got share option and the PlayStation button because of course this one is designed for to work with PlayStations. And of course PCs. But I, I prefer this one over the Xbox one because it has more buttons. And I thought if I'm gonna play stuff like this, I'll probably need a lot of buttons. And I do! You know, I use I use one button for the exhaust brake, I use two buttons for adjusting the exhaust brake, I use one for turning the engine on and off, I use the paddle shifters for blinkers, I use the rotary knob and the button in the middle for adjusting the cruise control and turning it on and off, I use the share button for uh, resuming cruise control, I've got the option button for changing the uh, trip computer down there to get different stuff I use I'm not really sure where the PlayStation ah the PlayStation button changes the zoom on the little GPS down there in the bottom right um, I've got the plus and minus buttons to the left here well you don't know that you don't see it but I've got it for the retarder and I've got the R2 and R3 buttons on the right for lights and horn res right, respectively, and I think. Straight. And then what else do we have? And then I've got the two buttons on the left, Go straight. which are used for splitting and range select. And then I've got the D-pad up top, top left for, well, up is reset the camera, down is left and right. Okay, left and right is actually... Yeah, I could be using that, I suppose, on the D-pad. And I don't know what down is. Did I? I guess it didn't do anything with the down D-button. Hmm. Oh well. Come on. Eh. <sighs> God, it's gonna be one of those, isn't it? Wait, it's a. F Wait, is it a four-way stop? Yeah, it is. What are you? What? What are you guys doing? There's a stop sign there on those that side. What are they doing? I was talking about this a few. Yeah, it's a four-way stop. I was talking about this a few uh, episodes ago. Let's see. Do they actually follow this rule? So that one. And now it should be the blue... That guy? Yeah. It should be me now, really. Not that truck. Well, it sort of works, I guess. Why did that take so long? Our most valuable resource sits here. Right. Oh, the driver. Oh, they're like... I guess they're trying to say, like, we care for drivers. Turn right. Huh. Well... I know for a fact that uh, truck drivers have a very low retention rate in the US because they're they're just not paid very well, they're treated like crap, um, they have to take on loads of fines and such because they always, you know, impose fines on their trucks, they, they have very short deadlines, etc, 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 so there's no... There's no surprise they have very low retention rates, and, uh, yeah. 
But now they have to do stuff like this. We care for our drivers. Please come work for us. Yada yada, etc. etc. <laughs> Man, this acceleration is ridiculous. Okay, we'll split this eighth gear. Wow, look at that scrap heap. That <laughs> looks cool, actually. Free pass site. I guess it's going to be a waste station. I am sure we're going to get weight. Oh, oh, no, we can bypass it. Excellent. 5,000 from Maximilian. Okay. Power! Power! Yeah! 84 miles an hour! Wow, look at this area! Is this like a... Yeah, that, that's the Salt Lake! Oh, that's so cool! I want to see that sometime. Whoa, look at that! Oh, that is amazing! Is that a baobab tree or is that no that must be like a statue or something look at this road oh that's so cool <gasps> oh I think I've actually seen this in I don't know somewhere I cannot believe we're actually doing 84 here in a truck I mean it would be governed but yeah that's funny that's another thing I would have loved to see the engine temperature and oil temperature and stuff like that actually rising and you know I mean if it's really hot outside for example you know going uphill it would, and maybe your um, maybe your radiator is maybe slightly leaking or maybe something's wrong and it would start rising so you'd have to back off and such and get it serviced I would enjoy that but like I said before many times I'm weird and my preferences are weird so what I'm doing right now is what a lot of truckers in the real world would call a super trucker I suppose <laughs> and that's not a that's not a positive thing that's not a positive name because uh, they call Super truckers, especially drivers that like to go downhill very fast because, you know, I don't care, I've got brakes, but they don't think about actually losing um, losing their brakes due to fading and overheating and such. Much, Stay anyway. Right, and then exit right. But yeah, I'm definitely not being a proper <laughs> trucker going 84, I suppose. Exit right. Wow, jeez, right. that, that has slowed down so fast, it's turn ludicrous. Right. How about that shift, huh? Man, this place is awesome, there's like nothing around, it's like a desert. I love it. Look at this industry here. Anyway. Thank you so much for watching. I Stay really hope left, you're enjoying this. Then turn left. We're going to be continuing next time. As soon as we come to a complete stop here. So yeah. Turn left. Enjoy. And I will see you in the next part of American Truck Simulator. Bye bye.